Welcome to the Law Firm Growth Podcast, where we share the latest tips, tactics, and strategies for scaling your practice from the top experts in the world of growing law firms. Are you ready to take your practice to the next level? Let's get started. Hey guys, welcome back to the Law Firm Growth Podcast. I'm your host as always, Jan Roos. And today we've got something a little bit different. So just going to try this out. Uh, I know you guys have probably been used to the interview format, but we're going to switch it up and kind of go over some of the content that we've been producing here at Case Fuel, very much in line with the stuff you've been hearing in the show, but just kind of a perspective that we've had from running the agency. So uh, first off is an article that we just wrote called What the Patriots Can Teach You About Scaling Legal Marketing. So I just got back from visiting family in Massachusetts, where I wasn't able to turn a corner without running into a Patriots hat, t-shirt, or jersey. While I've never been a diehard football fan, I've always been interested in the strategy and leadership that goes into winning at the highest level. I've often referred to legal as the Super Bowl of digital marketing. It's the highest competition, highest cost per click. It always has been and always will be. So when I was casually browsing stats on the ride back to New York, I connected some dots with a recent renaissance that's been going on with some of our clients at CaseFuel. We recently switched out call tracking provider to Juvo Leads, which has given us more insight than ever before. Where we used to have call data, we now have actual signed case data. Our clients have been growing faster than ever, and while I was staring at Pat Patriot, I figured out why. If you ask your average person in the street why the Patriots have been the team to beat in football since 2001, the answer will probably be Tom Brady. Recent memory will probably cement his status as the greatest of all time. Pop culture has a short memory. New England lifers will probably have the hard time forgetting the 10 years in between Super Bowl wins. And they'll probably never forget the historic upset against the Giants and not getting to avenge the loss four years later. The greatest of all time was there for all those seasons, yet despite the skill, courage, and clutch plays, he couldn't carry the team to victory for those 10 years. So that's a mark against the great man theory. What really came together for the last Patriots run? The wide receiver core. The Pats got another rock star and Rob Gronkowski, also considered one of the best to play the game, but it wasn't until it got rounded out with players like Julian Edelman that the loop was closed. Great passes turned into great catches, touchdowns, points, and games. And that's when they went on to win four of the five last Super Bowls, which leads us to what I'm calling the Patriots principle. To consistently succeed at the top level, you need top talent in all positions. Not even greatest of all time talent can make up for a weak link elsewhere. Bring it back to legal marketing. You might be thinking, duh, that's obvious, Jan. But when I saw the results of getting our own wide receiver core, I realized that we had been in violation of that principle until this year. Our team ended up coming in the form of an intake service ran by a former nationwide bankruptcy firm marketing leader, an offensive coordinator if that doesn't stretch the metaphor too far. When we ended up plugging in leads that we were generating online into an intake team with proven scripts, clients started closing cases right away, on day one in several instances. We haven't lost a client using this system yet, and several of those have doubled or tripled volume since getting started, where we and other agencies have been getting it wrong. No one is immune to man with a hammer syndrome. Running an agency, the answer to any growth-related problem was more, cheaper, or better leads. But this is in direct violation of the Patriots' principle. New England wouldn't have broken out of that drought if Tom Brady had spent twice as much time in practice. The team to catch the ball wasn't there to the level that it had to be. Yet, the approach the agency model is takes proposes to do just that. Pay our team to be your Tom Brady and rifle you leads in high volume with a perfect spiral that we've been honing throughout the years. Even if that is true, and after hundreds of audits, I can tell you that the real Tom Brady's are few and far between, it's not going to overcome bad systems. And after having lost more clients than any marketer would have the sense to admit, I can tell you that top level intake is even more rare. What we're doing about it. After seeing how much success our clients are having with this in place, I shudder at the thought of how things could have been different if this got solved earlier. In short, full article on this forthcoming, we're no longer t- starting engagements without getting the receiver core in place for a client. To that end, I made a totally free masterclass for anyone interested in getting intake handled for your firm. We'll have the link to that in the show notes. Also, for bankruptcy firms who are looking for a completely done-for-you process with the people and teams in this story, we're accepting applications at casefuel.com. All right, guys. So that was the first recording. Uh, let me know what you think if you like this format. I'm always available at Yannick And until then, enjoy and have a good week until our next episode of the Law Firm Growth Podcast. Thank you for listening to the Law Firm Growth Podcast. 
For show notes, free resources, and more, head on over to casefuel.com slash podcast. Looking forward to catching up on the next episode.